guys, it's me, Life Simmer, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4. I know it has been forever and a year since we played with this LP. So long that there has been several stuff packs and game packs to come out, and I honestly, I, I need to apologize, A, to you guys, I'm sorry, but B, to this family, I have neglected you guys. I feel so bad, I am so sorry. It is nothing personal, I promise. Yeah, I like opened up the save file and I was like, oh my goodness, I miss y'all. So I'm actually really, really excited to play them. And they have so much new content to explore. I'm talking, even an expansion pack, there's so much, so, so much, which is really, really exciting. And also, yes, I have heard about the new expansion pack. I honestly shit my pants on Twitter. So if you want to check that out, you can. I literally was going cray. It is called Get Together. And it is kind of like a late night, university-esque sort of expansion pack. I know your sims actually don't go to university, but it's all about like partying and making friends and socializing and, and stuff like that. That's what I've got from it so far. And the trailer looks absolutely amazing. This looks like an expansion pack that I will literally eat up in one second. So I'm really, really excited for that to come out and it comes out in November. So do expect that. <laughs> and uh, Cool Kitchen comes out this Tuesday. So also expect that. And now that we have this family going again, I'll probably um, extend this LP for another like 10 parts or so. Or I don't even know. And um, we can make a fabulous kitchen because that was always Candace's dream. And Cool Kitchen is also very exciting, guys, because I'm a huge fan of kitchens, as we all know. So this is kind of like my stuff pack. Just saying. Now, before we jump into this, um, I actually want to show you guys. A dishwasher. So we have a dishwasher and it is 600 simoleons. It came with the latest update. Can we put it in these? Oh, yes. You can put it in island counters. Oh, that is so cool. So, yeah, we now have dishwashers, which is awesome. We can load our dishwasher. Oh, my goodness. But uh, we're going to actually go on a camping trip. I know we've already been camping with this family, but we're not going to go camping out in the boonies. We actually have enough simoleons to rent out a huge cabin that is like 800 simoleons per night. However, it can fit so many sims. So I'm going to try to invite as many members of the family as I possibly can. Of course, with our family, we're going to invite Megan josh loco tyler and Ryder. oh we, we have to leave one of the twins at home we can't do that and i like how we can't invite jose oh that is so lame um okay i guess the twins are gonna stay back <laughs> it's nothing personal guys it's nothing personal i promise i should invite hank he'll be like wtf when megan arrives but anyways it's kind of like a tradition to invite hank though okay we're inviting hank and Luckily, we can afford the big cabin, which is so exciting. It is so gorgeous. It is the Lakeside Retreat. 943 simoleons per night. Oh, the prices went up. We are going to rent this for... Let's do two nights here, which is like half of our money, but that's okay. I, we, will, we will suffer. If that's what they want, we will suffer. Here we are at the Lakeside Retreat. Everybody's actually fairly tired, so... So let's go ahead and claim our bedrooms while we can. Uh, where's the master bedroom? I'm going to guess it's either that one or this one. I say we're just going to take this one up here. Um, so Nadine and Drake are going to go sleep up there. And then I'm going to have Taylor. Oh, my goodness. They should honestly, because they're like the kids, they should go get one of the kitty bedrooms. I'm sorry, guys, but yeah, it doesn't matter. I know Ethan's a teenager and Taylor's a young adult, but you guys can go sleep in the kitty room. Sorry, not sorry, but it's 1 a.m. Who just said, ayy? Because whoever did, you was my bestie. Just a slick, ayy. <laughs> but yeah, they're all going to go to sleep because it's 1 a.m. and they need to, but... um. I guess that's where Hank and Loco can sleep. Kiki Loco and Hank can take the bed bedroom over there, I guess. But yeah, we're just going to fast forward through this. In the morning, though. Okay, that hair, though. That hair. Oh, Taylor, get it, though. Get it. Oh, my goodness. Hair on fleek, literally. I wish. I could never. All right. Nadine is going to wake 
up, since she's my little chef in the house, she kind of took over Candace's place. She is going to head to the kitchen and serve up some breakfast. We're going to make some... Oh, there's so many recipes. We're going to make... Actually, is there a grill on this lot? Because if there's a grill, I will poop my pants. There is. There is a grill. Nice. We are going to make a breakfast scramble for everybody. Oh, she's having a shower really quickly. Drake, uh-uh. No, no, boy. No, no, no. Uh-uh. I don't think so. You can go take a shower. Offer a massage. Do not be creepy. Hey, Hanky Poo. You want to jump on that massage table real quick? I'll give you a quickie. Um, anyways. Let's see. Ethan should be waking up soon. Girl, can you hurry up and go make that breakfast? Go. I'd like for all of the girls to maybe do some yoga and meditate and do massages and stuff while they're here. Maybe the boys do whatever boys do. <laughs> go ahead and mop that up. I don't know. Drake, for some reason, is reminding me of my dog. I know that's a little weird, but he's really reminding me of my dog. I have bulldogs, for those who don't know. He's actually going to go hiking on this fine morning. Well, he's kind of hungry, and it's done, so... He's going to actually eat really quickly. Yeah. Call to meal. All right. Um, I guess Taylor will wait. Oh, okay. She put her hair on. Thanks, girl. I appreciate it. Ethan is coming to eat. Cool. Yeah, they're all just going to grab some food. And I did put down the buffet table so we can just serve that. And periodically through the day, we don't have to cook. They can just grab food because that's what's awesome about the buffet table. Your Sims don't have to constantly cook. <laughs> oh, look, they're actually sitting down as a family and eating. My little redhead family. Oh, you guys are so cute. I need a picture. Flawless. Just flawless. You guys are so cute. <laughs> And everybody else is sleeping. How disappointing. What little party poopers. I don't even know where... Oh, Hank is asleep too. Drake is going to go hiking. Ethan's... I mean, I guess he could. He's going to drink his energy juice and then he's going to go jogging. It's like a really awkward <laughs> breakfast. None of them are talking really. Oh, he's feeling pumped now. He's like, yeah, got that Red Bull in my system. I'm ready to take on the day. Good morning, Hanky Poo. Good morning. <sighs> He's like, um, I'm out of here, deuces. Seriously, hurt you all? Oh, he's going in the tent. Okay. You little nocturnal raccoon. So the girls are actually going to go upstairs and do some yoga together. They're going to go practice it. It's like perfect out. Oh, it is so serene out here and amazing. But the boys are going to go do their thing. And luckily, everybody's waking up now. All right, and Nadine has acquired the wellness skill. Like, look how relaxing this is. Can we just take a moment to see what she's looking at while doing this? Come on. That is like goals AF. If we head over here to the boys, they're kind of, you know, this one, Ethan's actually running and doing laps. And then Drake's just like in his black hoodie, just walking. <laughs> but I definitely want like, I don't even know. I definitely want Ethan to make some friends or something out here. Cause they... Hey, honey, how old is you? Oh, a young adult. Never mind. Keep going. Keep going, honey. <laughs> oh, 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 my goodness. That's not terrifying. That is not terrifying. Oh, if I was to be sent to the nether, 
this is it. See, when people ask me, hey, Christina, you want to go outside? This is what I picture. This is what I picture. This is why I stay indoors where it's glorious. SpongeBob made that song up for a reason. A magical place with magical charm. Indoors. Indoors. actually gonna have Ethan come over here and give a friendly introduction to the bear yeah oh he has to go pee uh-oh better hurry up then go say hey oh like hey oh oh talia i was not expecting that oh she said oh she's feeling flirty oh I really need to install a mod that allows me to be like, oh yes, honey, you into you into this? All this, this boyish body, you into it? Ain't a man yet, but if you like it, I can make you happy. I'm installing a mod because Ethan and this bear are meant to be. Seriously, look at this. Oh. This is this is true love. It's it's happening. This reminds me of Generation Season One, Tori Dunbar, and I'm feeling it with this. I'm feeling it with the bear. It just happens. Hey, it's all good. It's all good. Nobody's judging you here, Talia. That's what you're into. That's what you're into. What can I say? All right, these two are still over here feeling hella focused on being fit which is good. Uh, come like 3 p.m., I'm gonna have Nadine go downstairs and like serve some drinks and stuff, but Drake is gonna head back here. Okay, we're gonna go and change the station to maybe some winter holiday. I'm sorry, it's too early, it's too early. I'm sorry, I'll change it to some easy listening. Oh, and Taylor has improved her wellness skill to a level two. She can now discuss cognitive focusing methods and bake sugar-free Karab coconut cake. Uh, he's going to fill the count fountain, the fountain with some fruit punch and serve some. Ooh, could serve it all for two fifty, or I can just serve a couple. I think that's what we'll do. We'll serve some ceviche and chips, and we'll also serve some almond macaroons. There we go. Looks so good. He's going to grab himself some ceviche and chips. And uh, Taylor is feeling a little uncomfortable. Yeah, she's gonna go use the potty, take a shower, which, or you know what? Girl, you're on vacation. You can go take that bubble bath that you so deserve. And this one is still feeling so relaxed. Nothing is bothering her right now. She is feeling herself. I think this is Nadine's thing. Like she was into her writing for the longest. She got into cooking and maybe now it's time for her to take up the wellness skill. She is getting older for those who do not know. She's going to be a elder in I think a few days. So, you know, it's probably a good thing if she's working on her wellness <laughs> to be 100. And aw, have some brother bonding time sent home. <laughs> yep. That's it. Okay, so we're going to um, ask him about his day. Maybe be a little creepy and offer him a massage. Uh, we're going to discuss neighborhood changes since they are neighbors. Where's Megan? Where even is she? Megan? Am I missing her or something? Or is she running around somewhere? Because Megan was definitely invited. She must have been like, ah, uh, Hank's her? Nah. But Taylor's actually feeling a little lonely. So I'm going to have Ethan come here so they have some sibling time really quickly. Drake, go kiss your wife or something. Oh, she's she wants nothing to do with him right now. She's all about getting her yoga on. Go ahead and jam for a bit. She doesn't want you. Practice. We're going to have a campfire tonight, so. All right, Nadine. Calm down for one second, okay? One second. Go use the toilet. Take a quick shower. Look, look at Kiki Loco, like, strutting over. <laughs> I love it. She's going to restock the drink tray so we can all get a little bit of juice in us. 
And should we cook a gourmet meal or should we just serve up the buffet table? I think I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna cook um you know what since we're out in the wild do as the wild do we're gonna cook some camper meals we are going to grill up some shish kebabs because they're delicious all right is Ethan here yes he is she's going to talk about cooking and stuff by a bar we will pin that Level up bonus skill. We'll do that. Nadine wants to try for a baby with Drake. Honey. Honey. You was about to be an elder. You do not need to be doing that. Oh, poor Nadine. Poor Nadine. <laughs> she really wants one. Get to know Taylor. Okay, that's just sad. Call someone on the phone. Her life is so sad. Oh, I feel bad for Nadine. She wants to have one more baby. I only gave her two. I feel bad for only giving her two children. Uh, I don't know. I kind of want to. Nadine is the cutest pregnant ever. But I feel like we're good. We don't need another child. We're not. No. No. Stop it, Christina. You, you don't need another one. You don't. Okay? You're good with two. All right. So, yeah. These two are going to joke around and sent home of course that's totally the right thing to do a deep conversation um do an impression oh she just leveled up her charisma and comedy skill get it boo have these two bond a little bit sibling fun All right, because we are having like a little campfire tonight, so I want everybody to have a little bit of bonding time today. And these two over here, brothers as well, are doing the thing. We're gonna, K Kiki, don't be that girl. Do not be that girl. You talking to my man? Well, I'm gonna be right behind him. She looks like my dog too. My dog Gigi. She has crazy eyes. Go give him a hug. Ah, he's gonna go pee him himself, actually. All right. Well, while he does that, claim to be a criminal mastermind. Claim to be a criminal mastermind. Um. Okay, buddy. Serenade your wife. It's all about family bonding time in this part. Oh, so cute. So cute. We're going to blow her a kiss. Or no, we're going to cuddle. They're about to do some nasty stuff that the kids probably don't want to see. But they're doing it. Oh, no, I wanted you two to make out. Oh, there you go. Yep, go ahead. Go make out. Make out. Please. I beg. Please. Make out. You know your life ain't very crazy when you demanding sims to make out. Anyways, come on. Where is it? I guess we're going to have to work our way to it. Go ahead and give her a kiss. The kids are like, Mom? Mom? Dad? Please? <laughs> All right, we need to eat dinner in a minute, but I want them to make out before we do that. Okay, caress her cheek. Be enticing. Boy, you better know. Nope, we're not doing it. We'll give her a rose and then we're gonna all eat dinner. Mm. Getting dark, so uh, they all need to get some food in their system. I'm gonna move these plates over here. Is everybody upstairs awake? Hopefully. Yeah, here comes Hank. Where's Kiki? Kiki's sleeping. And I actually don't know where Josh is. Is he sleeping there? He might be. I don't know. Hey, Hanky. Yeah, you were invited, but there's not a chair for you, so. <laughs> yeah, don't pull a stool up, okay? Yeah, go eat over there. Go over there. Yeah, yeah. Bye-bye. Now, bye. 
I don't know where Megan is. She decided to just leave or something. I guess so. She's going to tell her dad that he looks handsome today. She's going to tell her mom an inside joke, and she's going to tell her brother a joke about monkeys. An awkward encounter because Nadine's very flirty. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. What does Ethan want to do? Be friendly with Nadine. We can do that. Be friendly with your mama. Can ask his mother about woohoo over dinner. That's what we're going to do. Hey, mom. I have a question. <laughs> yes. Oh, he probably wants to talk to her about it in a, in a different room. Probably like, I don't want to embarrass myself, but I'm really curious. But the fire is lit. It is time to hang out. So we're going to hang out with Hank, Loco Kiko, Ethan. Ethan and Nadine are going to have their little talk. And Taylor. These two are going to have their little chat. All right. So he's going to come sit down at the table really quickly. Taylor, leave. It's Ethan's turn with his mother. Walk out of the room. Ethan has a very serious question to ask his... Can I speak? Ask his mother, okay? Okay. Oh. <laughs> Everybody's outside. Okay. <laughs> Mom, I have a question. Ethan. Gets closer. <laughs> she already knows. I love it. <laughs> he got his answers. Oh, what a cutie. Okay, well, everybody else is outside roasting marshmallows and chilling. Oh no, I oh, know it's about to go out. Come over here, add a log. And play the, sing some songs, yes. Now we're sit and hang out. Yes, I love it. keeps restarting the same song over and over again. All right, we're going to tell a group story about a ghost story. Ooh. Yeah, we're going to tell a ghost story. <laughs> they're probably acting like they like it, but in reality, they're like, Josh, please shut up. Or not Josh, Ethan, please shut up. <laughs> oh, she has her fish. She's done with him. She's done with this campfire. She got what she wanted. Oh, yeah, doesn't a ghost appear when you tell a ghost story? Um, about that. Uh, let's not. Shall we not? It is 10 p.m., which means hot tub time. I'm going to... Oh, it's skinny dipping time. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, we can even upgrade it. Mm -hmm. Skinny dip. Um, I don't know if you should skinny dip with your dad and your mother. Uh, that might be crossing the line. Oh, she's already jumping in. Oh, I didn't tell Nadine. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I thought you were your mother. Stop it. Stop it now. Stop it. Stop <gasps> this got all kinds of messed up real quick. Real quick. I thought that was Nadine. Um, Taylor? Taylor? You need to go to bed. Good night. Good night. Yep. Yeah. Goodbye. Good night, Taylor. You're off to bed now. Why are you sleeping in the tent? I'm not, I'm not even going to question it. 
he's just ethan is ethan i guess get in there nadine skinny dip do it girl we're even gonna set the color you guys can be super romantic tonight we're gonna make it red all right shoe from hot tub <laughs> we're not gonna do that um we are going to Mm. Make out in the hot tub. These two are having a nice romantic getaway while they're still young because they are going to be elders rather soon. So why not? All right. We're going to not recite love poetry in the hot tub. They're going to woohoo in the hot tub. Oh, okay. Well, uh, how's everybody's day going? I hope it's going so well. Okay, guys. All right, come on now. All right, it's midnight now, so they're gonna go to sleep. Then it's morning time. I'm gonna have Nadine once again wake up a bit earlier than everybody else. Like, I'm gonna have her wake up now. Uh, go use the toilet. And this morning, she's going to cook up some. Hmm. We're going to cook up some pancakes. No, that's kind of basic. French toast. Hmm. Blackened bass. Huh. Da, 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 da. We will make French toast. Oh, I need a fruit. Does anybody have a fruit on them? <laughs> Nadine, you can cook that fruit cobbler now. Or not fruit cobbler, I meant... <gasps> Uh, French toast. <laughs> we could make fruit cobbler. You know what? Yeah, she's going to go make some fruit cobbler. Came with get to work. Why not? And we have so much dishes to do. It's crazy. I'm actually going to have Taylor go ahead and wake up. Um, use the toilet over here. And um, also change her outfit to her everyday wear. Oh, oh, she already did it. Girl, you already know. She will use the toilet. And then she's going to do some dishes. Also going to clean up the drinks over here. Nobody even had one, so they'll definitely drink them today. I wasted 90 simoleons on that. We ain't got money like that. And we saving up for a cool kitchen, so I don't appreciate it at all. But yeah, we're just going to go ahead and clean up a little bit. I'm actually going to do a little bit myself. You ain't Candace. You need to calm down, honey. She's grabbing herself a plate before everybody else. Ethan's awake. He's going to use the toilet. He's about to piss himself. And then he's going to call to me all. Alright, Nadine's good to go. She's going to do her morningly routine yoga sort of thing. I don't know. She's going to go practice some yoga with Taylor. And she's done eating. She's grabbing her cobbler now. Ethan, you can go ahead and go jogging. Drink your energy juice this morning. And go jogging. Drake is still asleep. Figures. Everybody else is awake. They're going to go do yoga and relax. Or actually, once you're done eating, you can do the dishes. Go use the toilet. Head downstairs. Grab a plate of fruit cobbler. And then do all the dishes. All right. How are you feeling? Focused, improved posing, practice makes perfect. Um, Nadine has found, oh, Nadine can now give aromatherapy, aromatherapy massages and perform the triangle pose. Ooh, she's gonna have to give Drake a massage today. I'm sure he'll love that. 
where the hell did Josh go? I'm so confused. Why? Why did he have to leave? Huh? Why? And that water looks so gorgeous. Oh my goodness. He's going to come over here and go fishing today. Because he can. After he does the dishes, though. That's for show. Come on, Taylor. I told you to come up here and work out with your mother. Oh, okay, Ethan. <laughs> did you do your little jogs? I think you did. All right, he's going to go take a quick shower. And is that bear lady around here, Talia? We're going to chat on the phone with her and not go to the bathroom. He's like, hey, I haven't stopped. I haven't been able to stop thinking about you. She's probably like, please stop calling me, okay? I cosplay. I do not, I, I don't talk to little boys like you. There's a difference. Okay, Taylor just apparently does not want to work out whatsoever. All right, that's what I thought. What's the matter with you, bud? Okay, go take your shower now. We should ask him about Woohoo. See what he says. Mm-hmm. Is bro hug and hug something different? I don't even... Okay, well, we're just gonna give him a hug. Pretty sure bro hug something different, but you know what? We're just gonna go hug our dad. Yo, Papa. Papa. <gasps> Papa! You the man. No, go give your daddy a hug. What are you doing? Why is The Sims 4 so freaking smooth? It's like, smoother than butter. Demand independence. <gasps> yes. Yes. Demand it, boy. He is going. He is running. Demand it. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, I love this. <laughs> this is the best interaction. Dad, I demand. I demand independence. Okay, bud. Such a teenager thing to do. I love it. Like, okay. Oh, and then... <laughs> and then mosquitoes come around. Like, there's a mosquito in his ear. I love it. I love it. Okay, then he's going to ask him about woohoo. I demand independence. So what's this woohoo thing that I've heard about? And then we're going to give him a hug. Yeah, we'll be nice after that. That definitely was not the bro hug. Oh, there we go. Oh, so click on a sim with the bro trait. So I guess they have to have the bro trait to give a bro hug. I never knew this. Oh, I should have read that. Hello. So it's only available when the two sims have the bro trait. Duh. Come on now. Come on, Christina. Oh, what cuties! Is that one going on the gram? Oh, so cute. Okay, go ahead and apologize to your father. No, no, he has mosquito bites. Oh, that is so gross. All right. Um, after that, go ahead and demand independence again. Am I having? No, I was gonna say. Okay, I need to. I need to calm down. Complain about everything. Yes. Yes. Ethan is me. It's like, dude, shut it. <laughs> oh my gosh, teenagers. Teenagers, I love it. He just goes back to his fishing. Give the woohoo talk. We can give it again and again and again. Will he ever get it? I don't think he will. Lecture about responsibilities. <laughs> yes. And we'll just tell him how much we love him. Play a social prank. We'll do it on him. All right. Go ahead. Become partners in crime. Claim to be a criminal mastermind. <laughs> and still with fake confidence. Oh, my goodness. Um, we're going to trick him with the ham buzzer. <laughs> I love it. I love it. 
what does he want to prank prank taylor yep okay we're gonna go home that just seems like the sort of guy drake is like oh hi guys oh uh, loathsome lecture oh. parents always believe they know best <laughs> all right ethan all right ethan calm down bud go home go home probably like i hate being a teenager it's the worst <laughs> i love it teenagers in this game is so fun like oh what are these two doing are they bonding doing some horseshoes hank's probably staring at the booty like gotta eat the booty like groceries calm down over there you creep but what is taylor doing actually just interfering just interfering Oh, she joined. Oh, what a cutie. I'm actually going to have Drake do that little prank on her. All right. We're going to dare to streak. Dude, stop. Ask due date. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Okay, we're going to ask her her due date. And then we're going to trick her with the hand buzzer so rude so rude but we're doing it <laughs> this game is hilarious oh my goodness this one this one i can't i can't it's like dad stop she says dad seriously stop that's not funny and then he hits her with this kiko's just watching Aw, she actually enjoyed it. They're really close. I love that. Really close, as we've learned. <laughs> um, We are going to do something together. Yeah, they're going to go play a game of horseshoes. All right. You know what? No, him and Ethan and Taylor will have, like, some, some bonding time together. Nadine, stop sleeping. Nobody got time for that. Go ahead and take your shower. Prep yourself for a massage. I think I'm going to have Drake give you one. Even though you're a little bit more advanced, he's giving you one tonight. She's going to go do some yoga for a little while while he plays with the kids. And then he's giving her a massage because she deserves one. She's cooked all week. And it just, yes. Okay, go join the game. The kids are just playing together. Come on, join in. Can only two play at a time? Not even close. Oh, Hank took his spot. What a jerk. Whatever. Whatever. We see you, Hank. We see you. Now we know the type of guy you are. All right, we're going to offer a Swedish massage to Nadine because we love her so very much. And we want her to know that she is the absolute best wife, the absolute best mother, all of that. We're going to offer it to Nadine. Go, Drake. Be the little suave, romantic guy that you are. You're you're pretty, you know, when you were a teenager, you swoot her over for the rest of her life. I would say that's pretty impressive. Not not many people can do that. So get to it, bud. Prank somebody. You need to calm down. So they're going to go do their... Get over here. He keeps rejecting it from me. Offer her a massage right now. I demand it. Is there something wrong with the table? If so, I'll be very mad. Come on, guys. Okay, all is good. <laughs> he has absolutely no idea what he's doing. I love it. Oh, she'll give him one next. She'll do aromatherapy with him. Oh, he acquired the wellness skill. Good for him. <laughs> just seeing him, like, pat on her back. I It's so funny. I don't know why. Just because it's him and her. 
How is she feeling? Very happy. Good. How are these two? Still playing horseshoes. Getting a little hungry. Still playing horseshoes. Everybody's getting a little hungry, actually. Awesome. Very nice. All right, we're going to offer a aromatherapy massage to him. We have L Lang Lang. I'm probably saying that wrong. I'm sorry. Uh, Lotus Blossom Lavender and Rosemary and Mint. We're going to do a Lotus Blossom. All right. Look, she's being all professional. She's getting the oil. She's ready to go. <laughs> He's like, yeah. <laughs> I've had a massage before. I've only had one. And it was absolutely amazing. I actually need to go get one soon because it was so nice. I got it for like an hour and a half, I believe. And it goes by so, so quickly. But oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Was it nice? Let me go ahead and do the dishes since my Sims won't. Hold on. Just give me one sec, guys. Really? I need a dishwasher. I can't throw away the plates, can I? I'm trying. There we go. All right. Lovely. Um, Taylor's actually going to come over here and serve some roast chicken and some sausage and pepper for dinner since everybody's so hungry and Nadine and Drake are doing their thing. She's actually quite tired, so I'm not going to have her cook or anything. She's not feeling too fantabulous today so she's just gonna go do her thing she's quite tired but she has a cool moodlet relaxing massage no stress no mess no fuss no worry such a relaxing rub and does he have one yes he does confident aroma the mirror scent of lotus fills the nasal passages and mind with confidence Ryder monette's calling he's probably like where's my mom she's missing Guys took her camping and she has yet to come home. Why didn't you serve the food? Do you ever listen? Roast chicken, sausage and peppers. Whip them out. Let's go. People are hungry. Okay. Call everybody to the roast chicken. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Hold him, y'all. Go ahead and grab a serving of that. Oh, did he win? Yes, horseshoe champion from winning a game of horseshoes. Congratulations, you're an epic horseshoe champion. Feel the glory. And the inner bro is coming out because he won. And aw, look at everybody eating together. The only one we're missing is... Nobody, actually. Everybody's here. I mean, other than Josh and Megan who decided they didn't want family bonding time. Whatever. Probably because of the kids, they have to head home or something. I'm not sure. That's probably what it is. She's looking at him like she wants him. Knock it off. All right, and let's get those drinks served up. Awesome. Now we have some drinks going. I'm going to have Taylor go ahead and use the bathroom and then grab one. Ethan, I guess, since you've been a good boy, you can grab one as well. Uh, Drake, of course, you can go ahead and have one. And Nadine can have one as well. Whoever wants one can have one. But this is our last night here, so we're all just going to grab one really quickly. Drake's like taking his last bite, just waiting. Nadine's so not in the mood to drink or anything. She's just ready for bed. So after she's done with her drink, she may go to sleep. Drake, are you not going to grab one? Is she in the way? Is she in the way? Nadine, get out of the way. Move. Yeah. All right, cool. He had his drink, now he really has to go pee. But I think I'm going to actually go ahead and end this part in a second here. Um, they're all going to be returning home in the morning anyways, so 
Um, it was very fun actually going on this like little vacation. I'm not really going to edit too much of this. So, oh, and it's Drake's birthday. So in the next part, we'll be throwing a rockin' birthday party. If you guys are not like interested in really long parts like this, this probably isn't the part for you. Um, but yeah, in the next part, Drake's birthday party. Uh, Nadine's will definitely be coming up soon. I want to have Taylor get some sort of love triangle going because she's she doesn't even have a friend. I don't even believe she has a friend going on there yeah okay nothing's going on there um definitely have megan Ryder, and tyler come over or something and have some rock and sort of parties since we do have you know some cool new party stuff it'd be kind of nice just to have the family over maybe a family dinner or something along those lines um also i would really really love somewhat i don't know I'm, I'm trying to think maybe candace come back and take on the baking skill and move in with jose i don't know since he's back already that'd be kind of neat and now Jose can actually go visit aliens. Oh my gosh, there's so much we have to do. But uh, yeah, I will see you all in the next part. I love you all. Bye. Thank you so, so very much for watching this video. To subscribe, you can go ahead and hit that button down there. And don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up because that's always nice. And if you would like to watch more of my videos, you can go ahead and click on my face. Once again, thank you so much. And uh, yeah.